Russian Revolution of 1917 divided the world into two ideological camps, capitalist and communist. For the next 70 years, the communists would wage a war of words and images against their capitalist enemies. The goal? To capture the hearts and minds of the Soviet masses with disinformation. To turn them against the enemy, who they said ruthlessly exploited the average citizen. To turn them toward the state, run by peasants and workers, which cared about their welfare and guaranteed them health, education, and a shining future. A minority party with approximately 200,000 members, the Bolsheviks in 1917 assumed the leadership of 160 million people, scattered across the world's largest continuous landmass. They spoke more than 100 languages and were, for the most part, illiterate. Masters of visual propaganda, after seizing power, the Bolsheviks produced tens of thousands of political posters. Striking pictures and stirring slogans communicated party ideology. Lenin proclaimed cinema the most important art for promoting communist ideology. The animated war for the minds of the people began with short political commercials that delivered the state's message in a clear and entertaining manner. Shown in cinemas everywhere, they encouraged people to form collective farms and join the Communist Party. They promoted the state's tailored vision of Soviet history and fanned hatred of the Americans, the British, the Germans, the Japanese, and world capitalism. <laughs>